other thing like tables that is non-standard but pretty well supported is the ability to make, create checkboxes in Markdown. So let's say I had a couple things to do like uh, get milk and crack eggs and cook bacon. Now, if I wanted to put checkboxes beside each of them, you just use square brackets with a space in between. Square bracket with a space, square bracket with a space. And that will give me checkboxes where beside everything, this is helpful for when you're trying to plan things out and you want to show clearly what is done and what is not done. If you want to mark one as done, simply put an X in the middle and that will automatically check it. This works well on GitHub as well where you can paste it in here. You go to preview, you'll see that they're always already on there. Another little GitHub treat that you have there is the ability to reference issues and pull requests in it. So let's say uh, I had the same problem in number 50 and you can see all of the errors in here. Font and sidebar is strange. Hit enter and it will reference that. But when you go ahead and preview it, people will be able to link off to issue number 51. Same goes for pull requests, but fixed in number uh, 86. And that will show you uh, where it was fixed. And you can also add people and you can just reference people all and that stuff will automatically link up. None of that is standard Markdown, but very handy when you're using uh, Markdown on GitHub. Mm -hmm.